Okay, my friends. Do you want to watch something on YouTube? Of course. Kirby, let's watch some movie trailers from the 1960s. Yeah, I bet these 1960s movie previews are vintage you know. Okay then. Here are the movie trailers from the 1960s, my friends. Let's watch those vintages. Yes, that's Mondo Daytona, or how to swing on your spring vacation. Filmed in swinging Daytona Beach, Florida, while a hundred thousand college students lived it up in the sun. You may see yourself or someone you know. Well, that kind of energy. Besides that, that good weather, lots of fun. It's got girls, girls, and more girls. Down in the boondocks. There's plenty of action in the daytime that was never taught at school. Man at night it goes and goes. It's all in Mondo Daytona and plenty more. Don't miss it. Fireball 500. The young thrill hunters of the racing game, guys who go all out to win, and chicks who want the winners and make hay whether the sun shines or not. Ow! It's fun and excitement all the way with Frankie Avalon, Annette Funicello, Fabian, Jill Wells, Harvey Limbeck, Julie Parrish, the Jet Action Crowd in a country carnival racetrack setting. They're goers who stop at nothing. Frankie's the favorite of the boys who know cars. Joey, we got us a real shot. <laughs> Fabian's the favorite of the girls who best know uh, boys. And their rivalry is not always on the track. Fireball 500 is one movie that pulls no punches. <laughs> No matter where the action is. Trying to wear a guy down. Are you getting worn down? Well, are you? Are you guys really going through with that figure eight stuff tomorrow? Well, unless he chickens, I'll be there. Good. I thought I might be doing a solo. I think you're both out of your heads. You could get killed. It's 500 fireballs of action.
It's the youngest, freshest, wildest motion picture ever to surf up on the screen. Hi, Sandy Ding. Hey, listen, how about a nice little... No. Sandy, honey, what is there about me that makes me so utterly resistible to you? Aside from the fact that you're irresponsible, incorrigible, intolerable, impossible, and insane, I can't think of a thing. Oh, daddy! Oh, daddy! Oh, daddy! Here come those whole daddies and beach dollies in the swingin'est young people's picture of the year. Daddy, oh daddy, oh daddy, oh daddy, oh daddy. Lots of dogs ride them high and wide. Grammys get all mashed up inside. Oh daddy. It's strictly for fun. For those who think young. Sure, this is the way they make love in India? Mm -hmm. Concentrate. It's mind over matter. Well, boys, these were some vintage 1960s movie trailers. These caught my big eyeballs. Ha ha ha. Well, you said it, Cappy. You have really large eyeballs, like I have a giant eyeball. Oh, look, Sra, Red Slash, and their friends are here. Let's go meet them right now. Awesome. Let's, Let's go. go. Hey guys, we're inviting you guys to see Turning Red, especially Jean, Katsuki Bakugo, Dora, and Little Bill have to come with us. By the way, do you want to join us? Of course. Let's go meet Team Sonic and the others for this movie. Come on. So boys, do you want to see some movie previews from 1970? Of course, Sonic, let's watch some movie trailers from 1970. Vintage. All right. Let's play those previews right now on this guy in screen. I don't keep a cat or dog because they eat too much. Little kids bore the pants off me. And when I go to a ball game, I root for the visitors. I never cried at a wedding or a funeral. I never sent a Christmas card. And I cheated my wife, if I had the time. But I've got one soft spot. A man is innocent until proven guilty. The lawyer. The morning rain falls into this new frontier. It's an everyday city. New editions of architecture. You know where Jim is? The gym? Yeah, if we come to town with the gym and it, just let me out of the gym. Because I gotta start working out. You know what I wish? What? Somebody asked me what I wish. Okay, what do you wish? I wish that we'd all be happy and, and be friends and have good luck. Damn it, I'm trying to score points for you and you're trying to take my chick from me. Yeah, well, uh, she ain't your chick, you know that? This hell ain't your chick. Big lover. <laughs> I knew you'd get yourself in trouble. <laughs> well, you get yourself in trouble. Why can't I get myself in trouble? Hey, because I can get myself out. Destiny is company. She's the soldier of her heart In uniform and mystery I make it a rule Never to make no promises I bet you think that I make out really good huh? Well, I don't, I don't I don't make out good You know those girls? You think I don't know their dogs? You know, sometimes when drunk I really think that they're princesses and I wake up and 
I'm just pigs. I just feed you like pigs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's the soldier of her heart. In uniform and mystery. Hiram Jaffe's world is just like yours. A little unreal. Dolly! You listen to that noise? Move. Some people think move is about moving. Like I'm uh, uh, setting something into motion, Dolly. Something I don't understand. Some people think move is about the system. Breaking down. You lousy kids, no respect for anything. Some people think move is about today's plastic culture. Well, what is that supposed to mean? We believe in a philosophy of joy and laughter, not in self-recrimination and rebuke. No shit. Some people think move is about the battle of the sexes. Doctor, I don't think my husband understands me. Is your wife so Austrian? No, Jewish. <laughs> Ida, break it, the glass. <laughs> Isn't that disgusting? I don't know what it is. I haven't made love to Dolly in months. I just can't. God, I, I, I think you really are going crackers. And you better tell me you love me or something. Hey, look at that. You've got green paint spots all over your chest. You've even got it on your... <gasps> oh, that's kinky. You gonna try something funny? None, mate. When we start picking up weird balls, I come for you first. Some people think move is just an entertaining comedy. Who is this? But some people think move is more than that. Damn it! I don't need this. In short, some people think, and some people don't. And some people just move. Move. Jeffy! The movie with a message. Waitress. Little Harold, happy birthday. You're just in time for the floor show. From me to you, darling, how do you like it? A happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday, dear Harold. <laughs> You live with your parents? <laughs> yeah, but it's all right. They're gay. <laughs>
It's my right to lead my sex life without answering to anybody. California Mark Crowley's hilarious play, The Boys in the Band, is now a movie. It's not a musical. Wow, guys, these were some vintage and weird 1970 movie trailers. Yeah. I agree with you with those movie previews from the year 1970. Of course, they're vintage and weird at the same time with those movie trailers from the year 1970. Hi there, boys. We have invited you to see Disney and Pixar's Turning Red. Do you want to join? Of course, we love to join you guys at the goals. Awesome, so let's get going. Everybody. Awesome, we have some more people to join us. Let's get going, pals and gals. Hey there, guys and gals. I'm Blogman. It's a long time I've seen you. Hey there, Blogman. Who's a ball? Ball and ball. Good thing you're here at this theater, boys. Well, dudes and gals, good to see you as well. You know, guys, turning red is going to be so boring as hell. What do you think? Oh, hell yeah. Dora. I agree with you. Turning red is going to suck. Yeah. yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Wow guys. Did you see some vintage movie posters? They're so awesome. Yeah, these movie posters are so vintage and awesome at the same time. Yeah, I agree with you, Tails. Yeah, I can stop looking at those vintage movie posters from the 1960s and the 1970s. Yeah, so, are you guys joining us to see Turning Red? You three, of course. We love to join you guys. You saw me here on it, boils! Well, Jigglypuck, Isabel, Ackman Boom, Tails Boom, Sonic Boom, Tails, Sonic, Luigi, Mario, Pikachu, and Gold Mario, I heard that you guys can wiggle your ears, is that correct? Well, that's right, Blockman, Red Slash, you guys. So, look at our ears wiggle. It's awesome and cute.
Well, wow, guys, guys. That's a that's very, a very awesome, awesome and cute wiggle. wiggle. Thanks, Cuphead Mugman. We have proceeded, you guys. Ha ha. You know, dudes, this new Pixar movie is going to be so boring as heck. Don't you think? Yeah, Dora, I agree with you. This is going to be so boring as hell. Yeah. The Wild Thornberry's movie is a million times better than the stupid Asian Pixar movie. Yeah. I agree with Katsuki Bakugo. This nostalgic Nickelodeon movie is way better than Turning Red. This movie is going to be crap. Hey, you know what I can do, guys and girls? What is it, Pac-Man? I'll tell you something really funny. I can wiggle my nose. Get it, guys? So, anyways, look at my nose. It's so funny. So, what do you think of my nose movement? So darn funny, isn't it? Yeah, Pac-Man. Dude, your nose wiggle is so hilarious. Ha ha ha. Oh, why thanks, Kirby. I appreciate it. You're so cool, buddy. Okay, everyone. The movie is about to start right now. Okay, we're on it. Red Slash. Let's watch the previews, and then, the whole feature. Everybody. Second, the creators of Toy Story. Good morning, fellas. Hey, what's shaking, bacon? Did you lose weight or a limb? Take you into the world behind your closet door. Roz, you're looking fabulous today. Is that a new haircut? New makeup. You've had a lift. You've had a tuck. You've had something. Ah! We've always been afraid monsters were there. Scary feet, scary feet, scary feet. Oh, the kids awake. Waiting to scare us. Twins and a bunk bed. <laughs> But what we didn't know is that we scared them. What happened? The kid almost touched me. You can't touch a child. They're toxic. If a kid ever got through one of our doors, the results would be catastrophic. That kid. Ah! Walt Disney Pictures presents... Ah! Kitty! That thing is a killing machine! A Pixar Animation Studios film. I always wanted a pet. That could kill me! Five, what are you doing? Monsters Incorporated. It's a musical! Put that thing back where it came from, or so help me! So help me! So help me! And cut! <laughs> What's the toughest thing about being a superhero? Trying to live a normal life. Whether it's pumping up. I got it! Dinner with the family. Or seeing old friends. Hey, Lucius! Hey, Speedo! Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. You are one distracted guy. Hmm? I know you miss being a hero and your job is frustrating. I just want you to know how much it means to me that you stay at it anyway. Um. 
Honey. Hello, Mr. Incredible. About the job. We know who you are. Something's happened. We have a new assignment for you. What? Showtime. The supers aren't gone. You can still do great things. Wait, they're saving the world to the men? Honey, where's my super suit? Why do you need to know? I don't think so. Your suit can stretch as far as you can and still retain its shape. Virtually indestructible. And that machine washable, darling, that's a new feature. Charmingly different from anything the screen has ever known. Walt Disney's Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. A glow with the warmth of characters all the world knows and loves. Beautiful Snow White. You'll just have time to wash. Wash? Fearless Doc. Our house. The lip slice. The, the life slip. Blushing Bashful. Oh, gosh. Explosive Sneezy. <laughs> Carefree Happy. Happy, ma'am. That's me. Grumbling Grumpy. <laughs> Women. Ever snoozing Sleepy. Oh, hard to get. <laughs> Lovable Dopey. And there's Prince Charming, the Heartless Queen, <laughs> and the Wicked Witch. Have a bite! Walt Disney's Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is filled with the sounds of happiness and the songs all the world loves to sing. I'm wishing... I'm for the one I love. I ho, I ho, it's home from work we go. Was it really just our last good night when I saw the light and I know that you've been telling lies? Oh no. Get your hands full of water. You snort and you snuff and go. With a smile and a song. In all of the jungle, no creature is as curious as George. If there's a laugh, he's up for it. If there's trouble, he's behind it. And if there's a chance for adventure... Can I have my hat, please? He's into it. Peekaboo. Oh, boo. 
This was fun. I gotta go. But George is about to discover <laughs> just how far curiosity can take him. <laughs> you followed me all the way from Africa? Now, he's in a whole new world. <laughs> and still up to his same old oh. tricks. Oh boy. I'm gonna want to put the cucumbers back on. Hey, that was fun. Bye-bye. <laughs> From producer Ron Howard and Imagine Entertainment. Mr. George is floating away. Hang on, little fella. I'm coming for you. Oh, my. Oh. Comes a comedy that proves there's no end to what you can discover. George, no. When you're curious. <laughs> yeah. Featuring new songs by Jack Johnson and the voice talents of Will Ferrell, Drew Barrymore, David Cross, Eugene Levy, Joan Plowright, and Dick Van Dyke. This February, get ready for some serious monkey business. <laughs> Curious George. There's no way I'm going to eat that bug, so quit trying. <laughs> Oh, wow. Yep. <laughs> that tastes bad. Definitely bitter. <laughs> Princess, where are you? It's very spooky in here. I'm playing no games. Well, at least we know where the princess is. But where's the dragon? <laughs> DreamWorks Pictures invites you to a land of fairy tales. Hey! Oh, no, 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 no. Dead girl off the table. Where are we supposed to put her? The bed's taken. What? Where an unlikely hero... Ah! You definitely need some Tic Tacs or something, because your breath stinks! ...rescues a fair princess... You didn't play the dragon? It's on my to-do list. ...from a nasty villain... Eat me! With the help of his trusty companion. This is gonna be fun. We can stay up late, swapping manly stories, and in the morning, I'm making waffles. Ah! This summer, ah! one name spells action. You're not exactly what I expected. One name spells adventure. How about him? Before this is over, I'm gonna need a whole lot of serious therapy. One name. Don't look down. Trick, I'm looking down! Spells romance. Uh, it's no way to behave in front of a princess. Uh, oh, wow! She's as nasty as you are. Come on! There's an arrow on your butt! Oh. Oh. And that name is... Shrek. Shrek? Thank you very much! I'm here till Thursday. Mike Myers, Eddie Murphy, Cameron Diaz, uh, John Lithgow. You love this woman, don't you? Yes. You want to hold her? Yes. Please. Uh, yes. Then you got to, got to tie a little peasant there. Shrek. Wow. Let's do that again. No, no. Once upon a time, there was a handsome prince who set out on a quest to rescue a fair princess. For it was his destiny to climb to the highest room of the tallest tower, pull back the gossamer curtains to find her... What? Princess Fiona? She's on her honeymoon. With whom? They're off. Come on, Shrek! We don't want to hit traffic! On a new journey. Wow! To a distant land. Yeah! You work in that hat! Where Princess Fiona. Well, this is it. This is it. Can show off her new husband. Ah! Our daughter has married a monster! <laughs> An ogre from a swamp. Well, I suppose that will be a fine place to raise the children. <laughs> It's a bit early to be thinking about that, isn't it? Indeed. I just started eating. Harold! Shrek! Fiona! Donkey! It's so nice to have the family together for dinner. 
DreamWorks Pictures presents. Uh, excuse me, I'm looking for the ugly stepsister. Ah, old friends. Shrek and Ducky on another whirlwind adventure. Whoa. And a few surprises. Pray for mercy from Puss in Woods. Fear me if you dare. I'm sorry, the position of annoying talking animal has already been taken. They're coming soon to a theater near you. This is taking forever. Well, find a way to entertain yourself. Batman, Blue Justice, trademark pending. You're still just a kid. Trust me, there will come a moment when your powers will be needed. <laughs> but you don't choose that moment. That moment chooses you. I just got goosebumps. Wait a second, did you steal that from Oprah? He's back! Papa's got a brand new stash. Since I've been gone, I've discovered the source of ultimate power. That sounds big. It's been on my vision board for years. Hope I'm not too late. I'm sorry, who are you? Name's Tails. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Step one, light taunting. Step two, I have no idea. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> Today's forecast calls for a 100% chance of adventure. <laughs> Return to sender. Face it, you're never going to get my power. Do I look like I need your power? Where are my manners? Sonic, meet Knuckles. The main attraction! Well, guys, did you spot some movie trailers with the character's ears wiggle? I've seen those reviews with that, did you? Yeah, Luigi. I have seen those trailers of Snow White and Curious George. These characters' ears are making my ears wiggle, dude. Yeah, boys, these movie trailers are definitely making my ears wiggle because of these two characters' ears wiggle. Yep! Same here, because these two char actors here's wig in a funny way. Ha, ah, you got the point. Guys, Dopey and Curious George are making my ears wiggle because they wiggled their ears in a funny way like my ears wiggle. Ha <laughs> ha! Yep, you, you say, say it, it guys! So boys, are you ready for the Wild Thornberries movie? Born ready. ready. So, little Bill, Katsuki Bakugo, and Jean, let's go ditch from Pixar's Turning Red to see the Wild Thornberries movie. That's an awesome idea, Dora. Let's go see the Wild Thornberries movie instead of this Pixar crap. Come on. Wait a minute. Where did Dora, little Bill, Katsuki Bakugo, and Jean go? Well, I don't rightly know, Frowaki. Why hello there, Jean, 
Katsuki Bakugo, Little Bill, and Dora, how's it going you for? Hi there Penny Parker Lover Chan, we're here to see the Wild Thornberries movie, right? That's right. I'm King Dopey San, I'm King Tyler San's younger brother. So anyways, let's get some tickets for the movie, shall we, guys? Of course. Let's go. So, you see guys, King Dopey San, King Tyler San, and Mephilus can wiggle their ears, isn't that awesome? Yeah. That's awesome, Penny Parker Lover Chan. So, King Dopey San, King Tyler San, and Mephilis, wiggle them big ears, dudes. Alright, look at our ears wiggle, it's awesome. Now, very awesome ear wiggle, boys. I agree with Katsuki Bakugo. Your ear movement was so awesome, why thanks. So, the movie is about to start right now. Let's sit tight everybody. Maybe I should just try the first line until you're sure that the attitude's right. I think we need to start laying him down. Okay, let's try that. John Cleese, 22, take one. We are paying this respected professional. Any more comments before I start running? To act like a frog. <laughs> How do I get myself talked into these things? A frog who thinks he's a prince. Voila! They call me Johannes. Trying to save a swan. Samba? To the rescue, mademoiselle. A swan who's really a princess. Princess of death. And that's just for starters. <laughs> the Swan Princess. Featuring the voices of John Cleese. Sure, go on, John Dobb. Race to your death. Sandy Duncan. No, it can't be. Jack Palance. Had to be sneaky, didn't you? And Stephen Wright. No, 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 no. In a fresh spin on a classic fairy tale. Dead. Eric. A magical musical animated adventure. Swan Princess. Summer! Summer! If you can't put your feelings into words, put them in a letter. Listen to this. I, I don't know how to tell you what I want to tell you. I'll never find the nerve to give you this letter anyway. But I just love you more than words can say. I'm in love. I long to have your arms around me and feel your body against mine. Oh, radical. But be careful where you put the letter. Take your hands off my daughter, Fruit Lips. Oh, it's the mail, man. My mother's in there crying. I hope you're happy. What did she say? I really like it. Michael, she loved it, okay? You look great. My son's in the next car. He's with my daughter. Well, what do you want me to do? Do it right. Oh, she loved it. Whoa. Well, what about you? Me? Oh, I have no standards. I mean, I didn't go out with you. It wasn't good. It was great. You and me, him and her, all together at the same house at the same time. Uh, one more thing, little boy. Oh, God. You get her pregnant, I'll blow you. No sacrifice. No reward. Secret admirer. What do you want me to do? Do it right. X, X, X. 
XX. Think I gotta write another one? This summer, learn how to do it right. See Secret Admirer. All right, name the town. I'll be on my way in the morning. What? Nineveh? You don't want me to go there. In a land of mystery. Uh, Nineveh! It's the other end of the world! <laughs> in a town full of trouble. Nineveh, the biggest, meanest city around. Those people do not know right from wrong. It's up to one reluctant asparagus. You are a Jonah. You are a big shot. <laughs> I have the Jonah plush toy. With the help of some fearless friends. We are the pirates who don't do anything. Oh, you'll know that's right. Nothing. Zilch. Nada. Oh, lovely. To go where no vegetable has dared to go. We got trouble. You are, you are... Fish food. Big Idea Productions presents... Ah! Archibald Asparagus. Bob the Tomato. Oh, dear. Larry the Cucumber. Perhaps I can be of assistance. Oops. And introducing... A caterpillar named Khalil. That is only half true. My mother was a caterpillar. My father was a worm. But I am okay with that now. They may be fresh. Uh, they're a fresh when we cut them. <laughs> they may be feisty. Didn't I tell you to get off my ship, you lousy leaf eater? Fire one! But soon, they may be lunch. <laughs> Jonah, a Veggie Tales movie. This fall, only in theaters. It is very delightful, but I must go now. It's one of the most beloved animated classics of all time. I wish I was a boy. Is that you, dear blue fairy? But that's another movie. Ow, you're hurting me, dear blue fairy. How many times I gotta tell you, dog rest, I ain't no fairy! Coming only to theaters. Is it really you? In the fur! Disney's teacher's pet. World, here I come! I gotta be a boy! The musical tale of a dreamer. Then with the dream again. It's not enough you dress up like a boy and go to that cockamamie school every day. Who is so over being Rover. Be a good doggy. This really stinks. You should smell it from down here. What? Until one day... Dr. Ivan Crank claims he can turn animals into dumb human beings just like you. It's my dream come true. Now he's taking a chance. I've got to meet that man. And unleashing the power of his inner boy. What? Who is that? He looked a lot shorter on TV. Maybe it's the axe. I shall make you a boy. Oh, that is just wrong on so many levels. A boy needs a... Coming only to theaters. Disney's Teacher's Pet. He's good. I wish I had a nickel for every time I've heard that. Since the beginning of time, mankind has searched for answers to the big questions. Where did we come from? Is there life after death? Are we alone? But today, in this very theater, you will be asked to answer the ultimate question. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? The SpongeBob SquarePants Movie. Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Shh. Bigger. Squarier. Spongier. The 
SpongeBob SquarePants Movie. kids here for the sole purpose of partying. <laughs> Nelson Delby and Adam Stern are about to get the break of their lives. Spring break. <laughs> for some, it's the start of a whole new education. Oh, hi, sweetie. What? Are you talking to me? Yeah. Don't you think you're sexy? Oh, my God. For others, it's a more advanced course. You can learn a foreign language. Or expand your present one. You can learn martial arts. Home economics. Sunny dives for your protection. Culinary arts. And all sorts of sports. There's something for those into the performing arts. And something for those into nature. Oh, Nelson! Columbia Pictures presents Spring Break. It's the reason kids go to college in the first place. I still don't know where my underpants are. Why, what happened to them? I think they ate them. One of the year's most enchanting stories is about to bloom. Now, Don Bluth, the director of An American Tale, takes children of all ages on a wondrous and spectacular fantasy adventure that will delight and surprise you. A troll in Central Park. It all begins when a lovable little troll named Stanley... I won't have him growing any more of those things! Flowers? is banished to Central Park by an evil queen. Oh, oh. It feels delicious to be so vicious. I'm the Loga, the queen of me. There, he accidentally comes face to face with a little girl. Troll. And her brother, Gus. Who's there? I'm Stanley. What's your name? Rosie. Watch this. Together, they share a remarkable journey as they experience the incredible magic of Stanley's amazing special powers. You've got to have a dream. After them! Until the evil queen discovered all the fun they were having. <laughs> now, you too can enjoy the wonder and enchantment of a friendship that grows and blossoms in a movie that will make your heart sing. A Troll in Central Park when you believe in yourself, you can do anything. Secret of a successful beer is advertising! That makes sense. You are about to enter the dynamic, high-pressured world of advertising. You're all yes-men. Whenever I ask you a question, you're always going to say yes. What good is that? I need men who will tell me what they think. Am I right, Reamer? Yes. You're fired. Get out! Don't look back. Press the down button. Here, creative people team up to exchange brilliant ideas. Ideas that will influence everything from what we drive. Okay, honey, do your stuff. To what we put in our mouths. I don't like it. All right, then picture this, and how about this? Longer cans. I hate it. Smythe, you're the uh, creative director. Uh, you got anything you can uh, throw out at us here? We get a bunch of guys. They work in construction. And after a hard day's work, they reach for some Norbecker beer. And they all reach for a beer. 
Each one gets a beer. Then they hold them up. Hi. You're fired. Get out. Mr. Femer. Yes, Miss Tucker, what does the lady executive have to say? I'm putting together a concept. And now, you're about to experience more drama. I will smash Anakin. And more action than you've ever expected in a light comedy. When me and my buddies are drinking Norbecker Pilsner, we don't like being disturbed. No one back pills. Have one if you're tough enough. I want macho. What has fear got to do with being a man? <laughs> Alcoholism, divorce, violence in the streets. We're doing great. You pick the right kind of guys for this sort of thing. Me and my buddies, case of Nora Becker, and let nature take its course. Commercial over here. Most commercials, come on, fellas. They are disgusting. They are degrading. Or are they? Let's find out. Uh, just trying to make a living like everybody else. So come on, guys. We got you Norbeckers. Beer. The funniest movie ever to come out of a bottle. The main wow guys. These were some awesome movie previews that were shown in this cinema. Wow guys. This new Pixar movie was so funny and awesome at the same time. Yep. Even better than Freddy Got Fingered, because we hate that movie so much. Yeah, I agree with you, Cuphead. I hate that movie so much. Yeah. So, Kirby, can we watch some videos on your phone? Of course. So, do you want to see some commercials and movie trailers on my phone? Of course. We like to see some commercials and movie trailers on your phone, Kirby. Yeah, I bet these commercials and movie trailers are nostalgic, retro, and vintage, you know. Agreed. Mugman, play the commercials and trailers, Kirby. Okay then, here are the trailers and commercials. I hope you enjoy those ones. Hey, Mom, SpongeBob's at Burger King. Can we go? As soon as your dad's done. Yes. Hey, honey. Guess who I am? Come on. Who am I? SpongeBob, no pants. Wow. And I live under the sea, honey, and a pineapple. SpongeBob, no pants. SpongeBob fever is spreading. Grab some tasty chicken fries and toys, only at BK. I can tell you this. <laughs> Two exciting new movies for your holiday list. I have a message to deliver. <laughs> Valiant is soaring on the DVD. Wish me luck! <laughs> and for more groove and fun, <laughs> you can check out Kronk's new groove. Well, at least not a cat anymore. Except for that. Valiant and Kronk's new groove. New on DVD. Each sold separately. Rated G. It's all coming together. Summer wouldn't be summer without your parents telling you what to do. Beach Boys, please, This summer, take a break with Disney's Teacher's Pack. On DVD and video this Tuesday. Rated PG. From the creators of Finding Nemo and Toy Story, it's the number one animated movie of the year. He won three piston cups. <laughs> he did what in his cup? With an all-new exclusive short. Earthling! Here I am. Love me. Cars on DVD today. Have we got a show for you. It's Veggie Tales, the hit family video series that teaches timeless values from the Bible, like honesty, kindness, and forgiveness in a wonderful, wacky way. These stories feature award-winning computer animation, lovable characters, and hysterical songs. Check it out, check it out. Veggie Tales instills important moral lessons. My mommy always told me to do what's right. This is the one series the whole family can enjoy. Veggie Tales is one of the most honored children's series ever, and experts agree that Veggie Tales is great quality entertainment. It's showtime! 
Newsweek proclaims it's a smash hit. Billboard says it's a hysterically funny series. And now the laughs can be delivered straight to you and your family. Call now to receive two great videos, Lyle the Kindly Viking and Madam Blueberry for just $29.95. Lyle the Kindly Viking will have your whole family laughing and singing along as they learn about sharing and friendship. This hilarious adventure is full of toe-tapping music and a fun story that your kids will never forget. It'll be great! You'll also receive Madam Blueberry with the wackiest shopping spree ever, where your kids will learn that being greedy makes you grumpy. Because a thankful heart is a happy heart. Cheese by the please do not get it. Every video includes a special bonus feature, Silly Songs with Larry. Come on and get ready, I'm coming down. I can't take a lot Call now to receive Lyle the Kindly Viking and Madam Blueberry, a $29.95 value. But if you call right now, it's just $19.95. And if you act right now, you'll also receive a Veggie Classic Song Sampler CD absolutely free. Your kids will love this great toe-tapping CD filled with wacky sing-along fun. You must be 18 years of age to order this product. Learning great values and good, clean fun are just a phone call away. Order Veggie Tales for your family now. <laughs> hey, donkey. Yeah, my wife is none too happy with how she looks in Shrek the Third on HD DVD. Why? HD is the best picture you can get. That's the problem. She says her skin's so scaly, it makes possible look big, like, like everything. Well, it's a high-def DVD, and she's a massive dragon. Did I mention we was calling from the parking lot? For truly high-def movies, get HD DVD and experience the biggest hits this holiday season. Your attention, all land lovers. Set sail for the SpongeBob SquarePants Season 4 Volume 1 box set. Available today on DVD. Are you ready to be a winner? This two-disc collectible box set includes 20 sensational episodes and a treasure trove of bonus features, including behind the scenes with SpongeBob and friends. You can't rush perfection. And two original uncut animatics. You can absorb the SpongeBob Season 4 Volume 1 DVD box set today. And be on the lookout for the best day ever album in stores now. <laughs> Football in run. true high definition. Oh, wow! Wait, he breaks free. No, He's gonna go off. Yeah. But what do you do when the game's over? Watch movies in true high def with the Toshiba HD DVD player. With up to six times the details of DVD, even your current DVD collection looks great. Get the most out of your HD TV and get something worth cheering for. The Toshiba HD DVD player, now starting as low as $149.99. Hey, SpongeBob, I painted a picture of you! Wanna see it? Mmm, that's nice, Patrick. But it doesn't really look like me. Uh, oh, yes, it's a Oh. What, what? No, it does! <laughs> SpongeBob toys are now at Burger King in celebration of the SpongeBob SquarePants movie! I'm ready! I'm ready! Wow, Patrick Pyway! You can collect all 12! There's one in every kid's meal! Only at Burger King! <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi, it's Gingy. He said it was urgent. He's a cookie. Gingy. This Shrek the Third HD DVD is just too amazing. It makes me look delicious. You look great. Well, HD is the best picture you can get. No, oh, it's making me want to take a little nibble. So many shiny sprinkles. Ow! Ow! Oh, yummy! For truly high def movies, get HD DVD and experience the biggest hits this holiday season. Ba blue, ba loo, ba loo, ba. The standard girl. And the classic bunk bed. Learn these techniques and more as Mike and Sally teach you the following fur raising scare. Get your scare on. Rated E for everyone. PlayStation. I never knew my father! The funniest fish in the sea! No, I know funny! I'm a clownfish! Are headed for DVD! Woohoo! Join them for an ocean full of laughs! Buy Finding Nemo on DVD or video from the 27th of February and get Toy Story on DVD for $5.99! If you think you know The Lion King, think again! What are you doing? Fast forwarding to the part where we come in! Here's Timon and Pumbaa's story! Oh. And find out how they made a king out of a cub. 
<laughs> the Lion King 3, Hakuna Matata. Buy it on Disney DVD and video and get a free Pumba beanbag toy. I can't get to sleep at night Watching my baby We're asking out all the whole night It's driving me crazy It's every color of the rainbow So she's for a piece of your It's in the sky Keep me up from round the clock I just can't stop myself from watching So she's for a piece of your Watching it It's a movie star Watching it So she's for a piece of your Watching it to see the VCRs at Crazy Eddie. You want a whopper? It's late at night. Come to Burger King and we'll treat your hunger right. Late night drive through at Burger King. Burger King. We're open past midnight. Late night at Burger King I should hungry for Burger King now You're witnessing one of the most momentous events of all time The world's first digital video system from Toshiba The Toshiba Digital VCR creates unforgettable special effects And the first 525 line digital TV is incredible Toshiba Digital Video. It'll change history. Big is back! Big sun, big sail, big splash, big wave, big hat, big drink, big kiss, big wing, big feet, big fry, big bite, big guy. Good time, great taste. Super size makes it my place. Super sizes are back. Larger than large Coca-Cola, super size shakes and fries. For limited time, they're as quick as a drive-thru. Big fries, big, big coke, real quick. A good time, great taste. Of McDonald's, big fun. <laughs> When the stars come out to play, baby, I twinkle and show, ooh, dinner out of sight. Yeah, the night time is golden light time. Dinner at McDonald's. Showtime. of a jet ramming through the sound barrier. One mistake, and there ain't no second chance. Get ready for a motion picture that will knock your wheels off. American Nitro. Well, what a beautiful day down at the strip Put my foot to the floor Well, come on, baby Give me just a couple American Nitro, a film that opens it up and gets behind America's fastest growing sport. Drag racing and the supercharged funny cars. If you're at your first drag race, you say, how can it be louder than that? Stand back. It's coming. American Nitro, starring Tom the Mongoose McEwen and Don the Snake Perdome.
head off on a life and death struggle as you sit behind their 2,000 horsepower engines and move into a split second kick that gets you off. American Nitro, a high-powered, high-speed motion picture with drive to win. American Nitro, the motion picture that turns Russian roulette into kids' play. American Nitro, see those dragsters and funny car drivers take their 2,000 horsepower engines and tear up the track. American Nitro. Webster is taking off for L.A. He lives to thrash. He loves to compete. But the competition is a killer. Check it out, it's hooking the dagger. beautiful girl at the club. The music of the Bangles. Animotion, Devo, Meatloaf, the Red Hot Chili Peppers, Thrashing. Well, what do you thrash? What do you got? You'd like to be held like that? Yeah, I'd love it. It's not a kid's game anymore. Summer! Summer! If you can't put your feelings into words, put them in a letter. Listen to this. I, I don't know how to tell you what I want to tell you. I'll never find the nerve to give you this letter anyway. But I just love you more than words can say. I'm in love. I long to have your arms around me and feel your body against mine. Oh, radical. But be careful where you put the letter. Take your hands off my daughter, Fruit Lips. Oh, it's the mailman. My mother's in there crying. I hope you're happy. What did she say? I really like it. Michael, she loved it, okay? You look great. My son's in the next car. He's with my daughter. Well, what do you want me to do? Do it right. Oh, she loved it. Whoa. Well, what about you? Me? Oh, I have no standards. I mean, I didn't even go out with you. It wasn't good. It was great. You and me, him and her, all together at the same house at the same time. Uh, one more thing, little boy. Oh, God. You get her pregnant, I'll blow you. No sacrifice. No reward. Secret admirer. What do you want me to do? Do it right. X, X, X. O, O, O. X, X. Think I gotta write her another one? This summer, learn how to do it right. See Secret Admirer. Lovely Marie. 
in county things are not as they appear there's plenty going on we need that high class beneath Life. good morning america welcome to marin county california where the search for the ultimate lifestyle is the goal of every man. Come on, remember I have a bad back. Hey, Rob! My friends are having a party. Every woman. Very apt, Carol, very apt. He wants me to goof off with him standing in a hammock. And every precocious child. Now, as far as Stokely's concerned, it's just a question of putting him in touch with his childhood. I'm only 10 years old, you dork. Serial. An adult look at the sometimes not too adult world of the country's most with it community. Eunice, meanness, usness, weenus. Sickness. Serial is a new brand of comedy. In an insane society, the same man must appear insane. Where'd you get that? Star Trek. Harvey. Harvey. Serial. Harvey, this is Mark. Hi, I'm a Harvey. Uh, Please, I can't. You don't eat it, you see it. Jack and Cecil are two of a kind. They like to think of themselves as the last of the plainsmen. What they really are is a half-caste Indian and a misfit cowboy. Two rustlers determined to hustle their share of Rancho Deluxe and grab as much of the action as they can handle. Starring Jeff Bridges, Sam Waterson, Elizabeth Ashley, Charlene Dallas, Harry Dean Stanton. It started as fun, but before it's over, the laughter isn't all that will die. Every cowboy has a dream of having his own Rancho Deluxe. The only thing that's different is how they go about getting it. It's the time to be young. It's the time to be wild. It's the time to be in love. Teenage Graffiti, the sign of the times. What are you doing with yourself now that you've graduated? No one does it like the teenagers do it. And they do it all in Teenage Graffiti. This is Chinatown. 
on the surface modern and picturesque, filled with the hustle of everyday life, yet still clinging to the old world, but below a volcano rages. Without warning, Chinatown erupts. The bloodbath that follows is the story of the Chinatown Kid. Two ruthless and savage gangs prepare and train for all-out war. The prize? Control of the drug traffic in Chinatown. The Chinatown Kid plays both ends against the middle as the two gangs, the Green Tigers and the White Dragons, use their knowledge and skill in the martial arts as well as the modern weapons of death in a brutal battle for control of Chinatown as they fight to the last man. Caught in the middle between these two rival gangs, the Chinatown Kid beats death at every turn. This champion of the martial arts faces incredible odds as you witness the most spectacular kung fu ever filmed. <laughs> Don't miss the Chinatown Kid, a Shaw Brothers presentation from World Northall, rated R. Combine the Dirty Dozen with the Magnificent Seven, and you have the Chinese Professionals. Kung Fu Beast. Siamese Devils. Tibetan Tiger Man. The Invincible Yuga Khan. one-armed boxer, a total of nine masters of the martial arts to tear the screen apart. The Chinese Professionals. Rated R. Now, these were some retro, vintage, and nostalgic commercials and movie trailers, Kirby. Yeah, these were some nostalgic commercials and retro movie trailers. Don't you think? Yes, I get you. I agree with you. Yeah, including the movie trailers from the 1970s and the 1980s. Yeah, these retro movie trailers caught my large eyes. Ha uh ha. -huh. These movie trailers and commercials are retro and vintage at the same time. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have an announcement to say to you. Dora, Little Bill, Katsuki Bakuko, and Jean had ditched from Turning Red to see the Wild Thornberries movie. Whoa, they're going to be in trouble, you know. Yeah. So, let's go punish those kids right now. Okay, we will on it let's go. Okay everyone, we're here. So, EGGMA and Boom, Tails Boom, Sonic Boom, Tails, Sonic, Luigi, Gold Mario, Mario, Pikachu, Jigglypuff and Isabel, Wiggle your ears to hear deep into the cinema. You got it, Sierra! Red Slash, let's do this, guys and girls.
so. Do you hear anything in the cinema, ladies and gentlemen of the KCPA gang? Oh yeah, I can hear it deep inside the training. I hear it inside the cinema as well. So, can we go punish the kids now? Of course. Let's go right now. Well guys, this movie is so many times better than Turning Red, isn't it? That's right, Dora, I agree with you guys. This movie is so awesome as heck. Wait, I see the Mephilus, King Tyler San, and King Dopey San had joined Jean, Katsuki, Little Bill, and Dora. I saw that in my big, blue eyes. Do you see it? Oh yes, Kirby. I see them watching that ugly looking Nickelodeon movie in my brown eyes as well. Buddy. Yeah, I see those guys watching this animated Nickelodeon in my black, beady eyes. And I saw those guys in my large eyeballs as well. Let's go punish them for good right now. Alright. Let's get those troublemaking guys right now, Pauls and Gulls. Holy crap. We're in deep, damn trouble. All of you go home right now. You're so punished and grounded for watching the Wild Thornberry's movie. Yep. Yeah. I agree with Red Slash. You are grounded and punished. We're calling your parents and guardians for this right now. Go home right now. Why the heck not, Kirby? Yeah, I hope these movie trailers aren't vintage, you know? Play the previews, Kirby. Alright then, my friends. Here are the movie previews from the 1960s and the 1970s. I hope you enjoy those trailers. Ha ha. This is no way to treat a lady. Christopher Gill likes to... Bang on doors. 
But that's no way to treat a lady. You found out, huh? What? Well, that I'm the strangler. Now say you believe me, say it. I didn't do it, I didn't do it, you hear me? I did not kill that woman, you must listen to me, listen to me. You may be interested to know that Dr. Schaefer here concurs. He thinks we have a paranoid exhibition of mother hate. I am sickened at heart when my own son goes looking at dead women's naked body. Mother, what do you want from me? Well, my mother, my friend, and I were famously close together, and we love each other. Yes, love! Bag midget. Lots of people are midgets. See how I fooled him? I'm a master of disguise. Christopher Gill likes to put on disguises, but that's no way to treat a lady. Are you really a cop? May I come in? By all means, officer. I killed every one of them. You? With my bare hands. You know something those hands haven't done? They haven't touched me. Christopher Gill likes to work with his hands. And that's no way to treat a lady. Ciao, 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 bambino. <laughs> Academy Award nominee, Rod Steiger, Lee Remick, George Siegel, give you the full treatment in No Way to Treat a Lady. Bigot. Go, 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 go. Christopher Gill just likes to kill. And that's no way to treat a lady. Don't say we didn't warn you about a motion picture that is definitely not for everyone. Can Erolimus Merkin ever forget Mercy Hump and find true happiness? Extremely sensuous and revealing. It took Playboy magazine 10 pages to show it all. They called it a zany erotobiography, the wackiest film yet. This picture is exactly what it pretends to be. Exciting, realistic, and so natural that it makes Blow Up look like Shirley Temple in Little Miss Marker, wrote Los Angeles Herald Examiner. A hair-raisingly candid film, erotic epic, Newsweek. A sort of what's new pussycat brought up to today's level. Filmed in the new style, slick cinema, bright wit, satiric barbs. Judith Christ, New York Magazine. Merkin is a ribald, yeasty movie, Detroit News. Extra care is taken at this theater so that nobody under the age limit posted in lobby will be admitted. Can Erolimus Merkin ever forget Mercy Hump and find true happiness? of children that you must speak today and the man said your children are not your children they are born of Aquarius and the only path they know is to the stars they come from you but belong only to themselves you all seem like such good friends we are we perform bird surgery together we draw truth serum together. We've told each other all the things about ourselves. So it creates a bond between people. And though you may give them your kingdom, their thoughts are their own. For it is to them that you bequeath the future. The future that you cannot visit. I love you both. Ah, oh, she's just a kid. No, really? no, no, there's so few people we can trust. Careful. Terrific. I trust you. I you trust, trust you. you. I trust you. We all <laughs> trust <laughs> each other. <laughs> when last summer began, they were children. When it ended, they were something else. Today's child dies. Tomorrow's man is born. Frank Perry, creator of David and Lisa, has once again discovered a cast of young talents 
And once again, he has made an unforgettable motion picture based on the provocative novel by Evan Hunter. It is called Last Summer. Get up. For God's sake, teen, snap to it. Your mother made five beta cap at Smith, but I don't think she can make a four minute egg. Jonathan, not tonight. I'm too tired. Is there anything you can do anymore? Mad Housewife, a Frank Perry film with screenplay by Eleanor Perry from the novel by Sue Kaufman. In nine days, we are giving a party for 100 people. I would like to see you do one thing to make this party a success. Would you come to a party that we're giving a week from Saturday? This is ridiculous. I am going home. Sit down. Sit down. I can't stay. You make me too mad. You're not mad. You're scared to death. By far, the Perry's best film. Great movie making. Superb performances. New York Times. An important film. Life magazine. A pungent contemporary comedy. Playboy. A beautiful and dazzling piece of filmmaking, Holiday Magazine. Certainly not a love affair. Surpasses the Perry's David and Lisa and Last Summer, L.A. Herald Examiner. Witty dialogue. The biting truth is earthy, refreshing, and strangely satisfying. Cosmopolitan Magazine. You're damn right I'm a sadist and you're the perfect willing victim. As usual, you've got everything twisted. What have I got twisted? Blisters the current scene. The best Frank Perry has made. Saturday Review. This is Dublin. This is my cousin Quaxer. He's a man with very special interests. Some men love food, not Quaxer. Some men love liquor. Not Quaxer. Dum, 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 My cousin, dum, dum, Quaxer dum, dum, Fortune, has a passion for... Well, let's just say he picks up where others leave off. Fresh manure! Fresh dung! Excuse me. Hey, do you really sell that? Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's my job. This is all about Quaxer and what he did to Dublin. Quaxer! Quaxer? Quaxer? Where's Quaxer? That's Quaxer. That's Quaxer. Quaxer, you well, are. Well, I got something on my mind and I want to talk to you. Now I listen. I have nothing to say to you, Quaxer. You just listen to me. Oh, it was foolish in the first place, the whole thing. Quaxer, please, I didn't. I. I'm sorry. How do you think of me? Quaxer Fortune found true beauty all over Dublin in small, neat piles. Bum, 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 bum. 
Dum 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 dum. Ding 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 Bum 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 Twenty years after the bomb, the past becomes a dream where cars are things that grow in trees and comic books are real. Metropolis. There's lots of cars and all the clothes are white and all the people can fly. I'm not here to steal your food or feel your women. I have a show. Now, the miracle. Cereal! Is there a city? Tell me about the city. What is the city really like? Take me to the city! Maybe we're gonna have some babies. Do you love me, Randa? We're not animals! We're people! We have to start living like people! We have to be civilized! What's your name? Sydney Miller. I'm Glenn and she's Randa. I haven't seen anyone in 20 years. Uh, it hurts! Oh! She's going to have the baby. Uh, 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 uh. Stars Day and Polaroid and Palisades Park and Safeway and Rock and Roll and Prince Valiant and the Holland Tunnel and Playboy and Miss January and Nick Jagger and Few words from the Steagle. You boo a band mobi, hobab bobin kaban. Right! Grobater brother Ben spoke beaker, spoke banger, spoke big sabik, spoke big trabane. Kabampi, jabaki, your best, so be the bee, bo bambino. Richard Benjamin is the Steagle. Like most men, he has a job, a wife. Where are you going? A family. What are you looking for? And problems. Cuba, Russian, yellow pill. Like most men, he has fantasies. Strike three! And memories. I love you. I will never forget you. So what makes the Steagel different? He does <laughs> what most men only dream about. Oh, yeah! Yeah! He takes off and leaves himself behind. Al Winters from New York. George Guinema Jr. from Paris. I'm Robert Hardy. Any relation to Judge Hardy? <laughs> <laughs> I'm his son. He goes where he's always wanted to go. He says what he's always wanted to say. What was that, Harold? Oh, you heard me, Payne. You are. He does what he's always wanted to do. Chung, baby, chung. I've never cheated on Fred. Uh-huh. In eight years. <laughs> 
Well. Let's see you. Nice. How'd you two girls like to have dinner with me tonight? Oh, I'd love it. You think you can handle two of us? <laughs> I can try. What's a steeple? Isn't it obvious? For Buck, you boo a ball! Richard Benjamin as the steeple. Three kids and a wife full of one more. I need somebody to bring me in. I was only told to raise the alarm. Cochise, and now the bloodiest Apache of them all, Olsana. What do you think Olsana's intentions are? Their probable intention is to burn, maim, torture, and murder. Where will he fight us? You don't mean to fight you no place, Lieutenant. He only means to kill you. To stop Ulzana, the army sent a patrol commanded by a fledgling lieutenant and his advisor, a battle-scarred scout. The scout, Bert Lancaster. The lieutenant, Bruce Davison. The sergeant, Richard Jekyll. Leave that body where it is. It needs burying. I want the Apache scout to do that. Damn it, lieutenant. You're not making any sense. Now look, Mr. McIntosh, that used to be a white man. Like yourself, a white man. Cut her loose. She's not dead. Why do you suppose they spared Mrs. Reardon? Maybe they thought she was dead. Luzana, leave woman for you to find. Lad, lad, if they come back, promise me you won't let them take me. Promise me. <laughs> Sana's reign, a battle of wills, cunning, and sheer guts between two grim fighters, two civilizations, the American scout, the bloody Apache, Ulzana. The Naked Ape, is it you? from the worldwide bestseller by Desmond Morris, some startling answers. Hey, Sergeant, did you know that your facial and vocal expressions were developed by the hunting ape more than two million years ago? <laughs> the naked truth about you, man. Can you take it? Did you know monkeys and apes don't fall in love? I keep forgetting. You know, we could be arrested. We? It's your fantasy. The naked truth about love. Courtship. Cheating. The raw basic drives under the veneer. The naked truth about jealousy. Violence. And the laughs on you.
It's quite wild, part of the old reward system. Do you understand? I do. Well, I, I don't. Fingerplate me. I'll fingerplate you. peek behind civilization's fig leaf. The naked ape is only human. Wow, Kirby. These were some vintage 1960s and 1970s movie trailers, dude. Yeah, Cuphead. We have never seen those movie trailers before, even though they're vintage. Yee! Herbie, I have seen some of those movie trailers before, buddy. Yep, agreed. But the first one, we haven't seen it before. I bet this is more like a comedy. <laughs> more like a comedy thriller, get it? Yep, you, you said, said it. it. Huh, even though these 1960s and 1970s movie trailers caught my big eyes. Yeah, Caps, your eyes are so big. Also, these movie previews caught my blue eyes. Ha ha ha. Thank you.